What if I told you that the future of architecture is about to change forever? Welcome to architects, interior designers and construction aficionados. We are about to take a deep dive into a world where creativity meets digital reality and we need your visionary minds to help us explore it. But first, if you are excited as we are about the future of architecture, go ahead and press that like button, subscribe to our channel and ring the notification bell so you don't miss any of our groundbreaking discussions. Trust me, you will want to stick around for the bombshell we are dropping at the end of this video. So today we are talking about the metaverse architects, the rise of a new profession or just some kind of scan. We will dive into the emergence of this job category, the unique skills and qualifications required and whether this is just a passing fad or a game changer in the world of architecture. So what exactly is a metaverse architect? Picture this, instead of designing a structure for the physical world, design architects can create buildings and spaces for virtual environments like the metaverse. Mind blowing, right? And I know what you're thinking. Sounds like something straight out of a sci-fi movie. But guess what? The future is now and this new profession is quickly becoming a reality. But is this really a serious profession or just a short-lived trend? Let's break it down by answering some of the most frequently asked asked questions about metaverse architects. What unique skills do metaverse architects need? Well, for starters, they need a solid foundation in traditional architecture and design principles. After all, they are still creating spaces for people to experience, even if it's virtual. But on top of that, they need to be tech-saving and proficient on various design softwares, 3D modeling, and virtual reality platforms. Oh, and that wild imagination doesn't hurt either. To better understand these skills, let's take a closer look at some of the essential qualifications metaverse architects need. So they will need a stronger understanding of architectural concepts and special design, proficient in design softwares like AutoCAD, SketchUp, and Rhinoceros, knowledge of 3D modeling and rendering tools such as Blender or 3D Max, familiarity with virtual reality platforms like Unity or Unreal real engine, excellent communication and presentation skills to share their ideas with clients and collaborators. Also, adaptability and willingness to learn new technologies as they emerge. How does designing for the metaverse difference from traditional architecture? Great question. In the metaverse, the laws of physics don't always apply. This means architects can design gravity-defined structure and create immersive experiences that are impossible in the real world. Talk about pushing the boundaries of creativity. And just imagine the building permits and zoning regulations in the metaverse, or maybe the lack of it. So what does this mean for the design process? First, architects need to familiarize themselves with the virtual environment they are working on, understanding its limitations and possibilities. They will also need to consider how users will interact with their designs, taking into account factors like navigation, accessibility, and user experience. And since the metaverse is a social space, they must think about how their creations will facilitate interaction and engagement between users. What type of projects do metaverse architects work on? From virtual concert venues and art galleries to entire cities, the possibilities are endless. These digital architects design spaces for social interaction, entertainment, and even e-commerce. If you can, dream it, you can build it in the metaverse. Speaking of dreams, have you ever dreamed of creating a perfect world without construction noise? Yes, the sweet sound of virtual silence. As the metaverse continues to grow, so to do the opportunities for architects, some potential projects include virtual real estate, so designing unique homes and commercial spaces for users to own and customize, maybe corporate headquarters, 
creating virtual offices for remote teams to collaborate and hold meetings. Also, retail and entertainment spaces, designing virtual shopping malls, moving theaters and theme parks. Maybe you can develop educational institutions, developing immersive virtual campuses for schools and universities. Also, a great possibility are public spaces and landmarks, crafting memorable, iconic structures that define the metaverse. These are all great possibilities. Now, let's take a moment to engage with each other. Let's create this crazy metaverse here. In the comments below, tell us what you think. Are metaverse architects the future of the profession or it is just a passing trend? We can't wait to hear our thoughts here, okay? All right, folks, we reached the question, the big question, the moment you've all been waiting for. Are you ready for the big reveal? So, is the rise of Metaverse Architects the dawn of a new era in the world of architecture or just another buzzword that will fizzle out? Based on the rapid growth of the Metaverse, the demand for virtual spaces and the exciting possibilities for creativity, we believe that Metaverse Architects are here to stay. That's right, it doesn't matter what Mark Zuckerberg is making wrong. This new profession has the potential to revolutionize the way we approach architecture and design, opening up a whole new world of opportunities for architects and designers to create immersive, innovative, and out of this world experiences. So there you have it. Metaverse architects might be one of the great futures of this profession. Now it's time to explore this brave new world and who knows, maybe you will be the next superstar architect of the metaverse. And if you enjoyed this thrilling ride through the metaverse, you will love our next video about the metaverse. I've shared some different ideas from one year ago and I think you will love to take a look on that video. So just click somewhere to watch it. And before you go, don't forget to like this video, subscribe to our channel and hit that notification bell so you never miss out the latest architectural wonders. Thank you for joining us on this digital adventure and see you in the next video.